mischievous thing. Hello. <laughs> Do come in. I'm very sorry. Ignore the mess. There's a lot going on right now. Make yourself your right at home. <laughs> yes. Well, you see, I've, I've received so many things in the outpost today. Oh, got to send loads of things out as well. It's a very busy time of the year, as you can imagine. Now, how can I help you? I believe you are a friend of um, Hannah. Yes. Hmm. I see. I see. She is a dear friend of mine, of course. Yes, um... Did you mention anything in particular? No. Okay. Well, of course, a friend of Hannah's is a friend of mine, so... What can I do for you? You seem to have... You have an energy attached to you, to your soul, and it's rather dark. I mean, of course, usually I wouldn't mind anything that has something to do with the dark hearts, but of course, if your mind has been clouded like this, I, mm, I don't think you could be of any use to her. Or to me, as a matter of fact. Mm -hmm. Somebody cursed you? Who might that have been? Alright. Now, why would they do that? Oh. Yes. She has quite the temper at times, I mean. Mm hmm. Yes, well. Can't really do much about that. <laughs> but. Oh, we've tried, believe me. But. When did this happen? I see. Mm hmm. Oh, well, you won't have to worry because, of course. It's been a while, so mm -hmm. most of it should have worn off by now. However, we should most definitely check to see if there is some energy left that is clouding your soul and your mind. Yes, indeed. Mm hmm. Don't mind me. Just see these just purple carapaces to get rid of. All the little rack spots. <laughs> we don't need those in the way. Now mm, maybe we should also seal the process just so that you won't be Experiencing this again. <laughs> yes, of course. Mm hmm. Right, so I'm just going to gently remove the bad essence. I'm going to just remove that so that. It 
like a complicated curse. Oh. oh no, not to worry, I can get rid of it. It's just usually the fog is black or green. However, this time Yeah, seems like there is also a hint of uh, um, misfortune. Mm -hmm. Yes, all curses can be very different, of course, but didn't you learn that at school? Who was your teacher for? Oh, well, <laughs> in that bunch of scary cats, aren't they? <laughs> but, well, we'll get you fixed. Don't you worry about that. Okay? So, let me just trace along your face for a little bit. by multiple people, not just that one. I see. Well, how come you... I mean, I've seen a person be cursed once or twice, but within a matter of time. Did you by any chance annoy someone, or was there romance involved, or anything of the liking? No. Hmm. Could have been, of course. Same witch. Always witch and always said, of course, it could be. Hmm. I don't know. You are a very unique case, I must say. Mm. Speaking of cases, <laughs> the other day I saw Newt Scamander. You know who he is? Yes, I know. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know why. <laughs> why they put up with him. It's just... <sighs> Didn't you know his case? Oh, goodness, there was a whole thing that happened a few years back. Um, some of his magical creatures, they were set loose due to a little accident. And, well, I mean, in, in my opinion, I think he should have had his wand taken away from him. And maybe a little more. he had many friends to help him out, so... Anyhow, <laughs> enough about him. We're focusing on you here. Now... Uh, what is your... Or what was your favourite subject at school? I see. Were you good at the subject? Mm hmm Yes. Peculiar. You see, most people I've come across who were cursed, they also were a big fan of transfiguration. Yes. I'm wondering if there is a, a certain something that connects these things. I don't know. Anyhow. Just take 
he spits out just very gently. Mm hmm. That's what I was talking about. Yes. Ah, there we go. And get rid of that. Get rid of that. Mm hmm. Good. Good, good, good. Mm hmm. Yes, there's some progress here. I'm liking that. for just purple carapaces. Why is that? Oh, yes, yes. Mm, they are a part of that potion, you're right. <laughs> Why did you have to try that? Very unusual for your age. Oh, of course. Mm -hmm. I'd have to say my least favourite potion I'd go with Polyjuice Potion. Seems like a lot of people obviously don't like that one, but mm, I can't really think of one right now. <laughs> but, yeah. Okay, it's looking a little bit clearer. Huh? visit Ollivanders, just to make sure. Yes, I think that would be a good idea. <laughs> because, of course, knowledge is important, and your skill, but of course it would be nothing without your wand, of course. Some spells can be performed without, but as we all a lot better to always have the wand ready. Mm -hmm. Obviously, depending on what your wand is made out of, you can expect different outcomes. For example, mine um, is usually a lot better when it comes to herbology, but I've had it for such a long time learnt to adapt a little bit. Yes. Mm. It's all about having a connection with your wand, of course. Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. Take all that. Good. Now make sure next time you meet new people that you cast some protective spells onto yourself or you carry some stones with you. Now, where do I have mine? Well, I do have a quartz here. Not necessarily to be used for protection, although I have heard some people use them for that. They keep them in their pockets with them at all times, but this one I would use in matters of love. Giving love, receiving love. Hmm. Yes. It's very beautiful. 
beautiful stay, don't you think? Yeah. As a matter of fact, I might use this to cast a little layer of protection onto you. Mm -hmm. Once we've taken out all the uh, bad energy from those curses. I really wonder who did this to you. Hmm. I mean, I could give you a potion that might be able to tell, but I don't know. It tastes revolting. You don't want it? It's okay. <laughs> okay, right. Okay. Mm-hmm. to be too aggressive here. Um, if I do do things in a more aggressive manner, I usually do it when it's a curse that's very fresh. Um, also depending on what kind of curse it is, because some last a lot longer than others. Some can potentially last a lifetime if you're not careful. As long as you look after yourself, everything should be fine. Okay? Good. If you have any questions, always come to me. Or to Hannah, obviously. But... Okay. I just want to look at the corners here as well. How is your body feeling? Okay. Any different than than usual or oh. I'm going to cast some love and protection onto you. Okay. It's going to wash all over you. All over you. Okay. Just so that you don't get cursed again. <laughs> okay. Good. And glitzy, 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 glitzy. Good. Wonderful. Ah, see, all the negativity is just flying away from you. That's perfect. a bit better. Good. I'm glad. Right. <laughs> okay. Perfect. 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 All right. Mm -hmm. There we go. That's the last bit. Okay. So how are you feeling now? Good. Oh, good, I'm relieved. Yeah. Was this the first time that you've been? Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah, it did seem rather strange at first, but I think it probably looked this bad because this was your very first curse. Hmm. You don't have to worry. We removed everything and I put some um, healing and protection onto you, so that means you won't have to worry about anything coming back soon, okay? Yeah, of course. Right, so since you are a friend of Hannah's, you will not have to pay me. It's all good. So, do me a favour when you leave. Um, don't look anybody into the eyes, um, not for too long at least, because uh, this road, um, the witches and wizards are very, um, well, they like to jinx and hex people, so <laughs> just be careful. <laughs> and please, of course, send my kindest wishes to Anna, okay? love to see her again soon. 
Mm. I heard she's opening up a shop in Nocturne Alley soon, actually. Yes. I don't know what it's going to be, but I'm sure it's going to be fantastic. So, you best be on your way, and well, it was very nice meeting you. I hope I see you again very soon. Okay, have a great day, and get home safely.